hey guys, it's Adam back with you with a new video. If you guys heard, and I'm sure that you have heard about this, Samsung has stopped the Galaxy Note 7 from so selling the device temporarily, which means Samsung stopped selling the Galaxy Note 7. And there is a reason for that, and I'm gonna talk about it in this video. The reason actually is because a lot of the Galaxy Note 7s that has been sold, most of them had been exploded or actually burnt. And it may drive you insane, but this is something really serious, and it has been even on the news. And there's even some airlines on Australia that, to that told the customers who have the Galaxy Note 7 to turn the phone off when they're on the plane or not charge it. Now this may sound really serious, and this even made a lot of other airlines to um, sue the company and sue Samsung for this issue that they have with the Galaxy Note 7. And regarding these issues and all the news that has been happening, we want to know what's the reason for this causing. And the reason is really simple actually. It's because of the lithium battery that has been in the Galaxy Note 7. It's not an issue with the motherboard or the screen or any internal data, but it's the battery which causes this damage and this exploding or this fire. And there has been a number of Galaxy Note 7s that has been shipped with this issue and the number exactly is 40 or 36 if I'm not mistaken. Now this may sound small regarding the 2 million pieces of Galaxy Note 7 that Samsung has been sold. I mean 40 to 2 million is a long distance number but it may be a really big issue with the other devices that has not been yet damaged or, or have been burned. Now Samsung said to all the stores to bring the Galaxy Note 7s back to shipping and also have told the customers who have bought the Galaxy Note 7 with three options. The first option will be wait two weeks or more and Samsung will ship you another Galaxy Note 7. And the second option will be trading your Galaxy Note 7 with the Galaxy Note 5 or even a Galaxy S7. And the third option which is my most important option of all Samsung said that you can even get a refund for the price that you got with the Galaxy Note 7. And that means that Samsung's really big priority is consumer safety, unlike other companies. And why the third option is really important to me is that this option that Samsung provided for all the consumers or the customers of the Galaxy Note 7, this will cause them to lose a lot of money. And just now Samsung has almost lost 7 million dollars which is a big amount of money for a company like Samsung. And the reason for all this media and social media talking about this issue with the Galaxy Note 7 and really making it big is something not shocking actually. The, the only th shocking thing is that it has been a big news but you should also know these issues have happened before such as the iPhone 6 Plus or as you may call it the plus bend gate or even the LG G4 boot loop which happened last year and LG said that the devices that has been manufactured from May 2015 until September 2015 will all be brought back to the LG factory and the consumer or the customer will have a new device. So that's all of my information on the Galaxy Note 7 issue or damaging problem. If I have missed anything, please be sure to comment below, I'll be happy to read it. And if you saw this video important and helpful, please subscribe and like this video, it will really help me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and until next time, peace out.